Gandalf the Grey was asking us to help Frodo Baggins, Samwise Gamgee, Pedigree and Took and Merry to reach the Bree unharmed and also protect them against the Nazgûls. And if Gandalf calls for aid, we will answer. Let's get it started. Come along, Samwise. Keep up. Be careful, both of you. The enemy has many spies in his service. Birds. Beasts. Is it safe? Look at the graphics though. Look at the feats from the hobbits, guys. That looks oh, awesome. Never put it on. Never put it, it on. The Dark Lord will be drawn to its power. Always remember Frodo. The ring is trying to get back to its master. It wants to be found. It wants to be found. He is a Mark Gandalf the Grey. <laughs> Alright. He doesn't have the Shadow of X just yet because he's still only Gandalf the Grey. But if Gandalf calls you one day and he's asking you for a favor, Frodo? you have to answer, guys, okay? Frodo! Frodo! I thought I'd lost you. Sam, we're still in the Shire. What could possibly happen? Frodo! Mary! It's Frodo Baggins! Hello, Frodo! What are you doing? You've been in the farmer maggots crop. Go there, Run, you hobbits. He's angry. It's only a couple of carrots and some cabbages, and and those three bags of potatoes that we left him last week. Yes, Pippin. My point is, he's clearly overreacting. He is clearly overreacting indeed. It's so funny when they are screaming like that. I think I've broken something. Stand, Hobbits. What? That was just a detour. A shortcut. A shortcut to what? Mushrooms. Mushrooms. Timo. <laughs> Do you know Timo from League of Legends, guys? Let me know in the comment section down below, please. Uh oh. Someone is angry. The Nazgûls are looking for the One Ring to bring it to the Dark Lord Sauron to Mount Doom. On their black horse. They are looking scary, and indeed the halflings, and also myself, are scared. What is going on? That black rider was looking for something. I have to leave the Shire. Sam and I must get debris. Buckleberry Ferry. Buckleberry Ferry, alright. Now we know what to do. Uh, first of all, you see cinematics at the bottom left side as well. You see that? They are hiding from the uh, wait a second. No, no, no. Why I'm using cloak? Actually, it's fine. So we can either pick Riding Horn or the Mist, uh, the Height. Uh, let's pick this one. So we can actually use that in the worst case to keep our hobbits protected. Okay, let's move now. Uh, we need to find Bree, okay? That's the plan. And hobbits, they need to be unharmed because that's what Gandalf was asking us for, okay? Alright, let's keep moving to the top side. Uh, we have heal in the worst case. I don't know if the Nazgul can actually one-shot the hobbits or not. Uh, but I don't want to risk the biscuits too. You know, I don't, I don't want to risk it. Uh oh, there is a Nazgul. Let's get cloaked. Look out. You see, he's looking for the halflings. Of course, the ring raid. He's looking like this. But he doesn't move also one centimeter from his spot. You need to move. Because if he doesn't move, he can't pass from this pathway. Uh oh, he's chasing us. Holy moly, run for your lives, hobbits. Black Riders, Black riders close, of course. Man. Run. Too close. Run, you fools. Uh, make sure to, to not be separated from each other. He is still on the hunt. He is chasing us. But it looks like we will be able to get away from him. Which is pretty, pretty good. Okay, we need to reach uh, the Bree. But the map is like a labyrinth, so we can't move through these pathways. We, need to, we can only use the way, you know? You see that? He's still chasing us, by the way. But is there only one Nazgul? I'm actually wondering. If there is only one Nazgul, we should be in a safe spot. Look, Samwise Gamgee. Uh oh. Keep moving, keep moving. I think we beat them. Oh, he can come. Oh, he can move from this? Really? That's cheating, dude. We can't go like this, but he can do that. Alright, I didn't know that. So we need to keep moving now as he's chasing us. Or trying to look for the hobbits. And every time you use the height here quick, you can get invisible, you know? Close. And of course, for the difficulty, we are using the hardest one. Because you know me, guys. I like challenges. I don't want it to be easy. To, to be too easy, actually. 
Because when it's too easy, it's also not very enjoyable, at least for me. Okay, oh. Cloak, one more time. Away. Go away! Go away! <laughs> I don't know, man. I don't think he's gonna listen to you, bro. Alright, let's keep moving. And now we're gonna go upside. I think this is the right place to go. We shall see. Move ahead. And one thing I can recommend you guys to do in this one is definitely make sure to save. What? What is Frodo Baggins doing? Frodo Baggins is always doing his own thing, you know what I'm saying? I gotta be honest, I think... I, think they want us here. I think... Can he actually go... Yeah, he can. Wait for him. Frodo Baggins is always doing his own thing, but I gotta be honest with you guys. Keep mo move away, Nazgul. Come on, ring raid. Please don't stay there. How can we move now? <laughs> he is staying literally next to Frodo Baggins. Move! Doesn't want to move? So what I'm supposed to do here now? I'm actually wondering. I'm gonna move actually. Oh, oh look, okay. Oh, I was scared for a second that he will be one-shotting us, but no, no, no. We must keep our eyes open. Okay, let's run for your lives, Hobbits. Actually, he's stopping. He doesn't want to chase any further. I'm fine with that. I'm absolutely fine with that. We need, we need to reach this spot. But again, this map is like a labyrinth, you know? We can't move through these pathways, which Nazgûls can use easily. So we need to be extremely careful to not lose one of our hobbits, because if we do, I think we're gonna fail this one. And you need to make sure to save a couple of times, because if you ever fail, you will start from the beginning. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Okay, he stops chasing. What is that? Who's this? It was not a part of the movie, though. And this is the campaign for... Frodo Baggins is my name. And this is Samwise Gamgee. You are safe here, my friends. Okay. Frodo, I know of your burden. Allow us to do our part in lessening its weight. Alright. This is the campaign for the Fellowship of the Ring. And soon they're gonna release also the two towers. And I'm excited about this one. You gotta be careful. Do not fear this evil. Do not fear this evil. Alright. Defend Gil uh, Dildor's camp from the rising Dunedain. Alright. Let's Let's use whole ground stands to make them tank here. Drive them back. Should be fine. We are in a fine Breathe spot right now. Last. Punch through. Enemies of the elves. Enemies of the elves. Impale them. You won't take okay, we are in a safe spot. This Elven warriors no, though. No, no, no. Noldo warriors, they are very, very strong. I also like the fact um, like the way they are looking. I mean we saw them, the Elven units, uh, the Elven, you know, people moving no in the film in the film Fellowship of the Ring, but we didn't they see them fighting. Kill this. Okay. I think I have a oh, 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 oh. Be careful with the hobbits. You wanna always make sure that you are not tanking any damage. With the hobbits, very important actually. And fighting around the well should be fine because, as you can see, we are recovering over time. This is the well of uh, Celabrian. They are losing some units left and right. To these units, they are actually very strong. Uh, Hobbits, please do something. I don't know why this guy is not attacking. He's not doing anything. Okay, now every Hobbit beside Frodo Baggins is level 2. And actually, Mary is even level 3, just like that. Pretty good, pretty good. And we lost a lot of units. Okay, we defended this one. Something is actually beaconing on the map. Okay, we need to, I believe, destroy those white slayers, the barrows. Okay. Are we full you HP? Almost alone. full HP. Let's actually not Shadow waste any time and let's keep moving. We cannot delay. We cannot delay. Alright. Hobbits move, please. Stay together. To together you are stronger. Shall Kill the Nazgul first, surprised. the ring raid. Return to the shadow, and also in Glorion, uh, Gildo is hitting like a truck. Look his damage against the Nazgul, but we need to be careful. I don't want to... Oh, that is... What is that? Tom Bombadillo! Daisu! <laughs> He's singing and stuff. Uh oh Don't chase the Hobbits. I'm, I, I think we are fine. We are fine. We have also heal in the worst case from the Spellbook, which is called King's Foil. This one. So we are in a safe spot. Trust me on that one. Okay. Let's destroy this one. Just like that. Beautiful. Grab the money. Beautiful. Hurry! Alright, now we can actually use only Tom Bombadil. I think he can solo that. He has Sonic Song, we know that already from Rise of the Witch King, but he has even more than that. He has Incorruptible. 
and nothing may harm the master of wood. Water and, water and heal from Bombardier temporarily becomes immune to damage and it's resistant to knockback. Indeed, he doesn't take too much damage anyway. So they can turn and actually go for the Visa Blast. Boom! Bombadillo, I like the way he's dancing and stuff, you know? Get the money, there we go. Money is always nice. And we can now destroy the last uh, barrel at the top side. And once again, all alone with Tom Bombadillo. What is this? What happened? What is that actually? Old Man Willow, uh, enemy units around him are put to sleep. Okay, I mean, only units though, not heroes. And someone is attacking it. But who's this person? Let me check him. Ah, oh, he's gone already. <laughs> okay. Come on, is just very, very. Oh, what? He's still around? Oh no, he's gone. He's gone. Come on, is so strong here, and he's the only one uh, who doesn't get affected by the one. What? Now they are actually they woke up again because this ring raid destroyed the thing. Get the money. Oh, we can't get the money because. <laughs> and this guy is keeps you know, <laughs> keeps dancing and singing, you know. <laughs> Someone is waiting for you there. Thank you, my friend. Farewell, Frodo Baggins. Farewell, Inglorion. Thanks for the safety. And look, Tom Bombadil is still dancing around and stuff. You see him? <laughs> okay. Now what we need to do is we need to reach the Buckleberry Ferry, and also the Prancing Pony. Okay. Okay, where, have, where do we need to go? I think here, okay. That is the boat, so we need to take the boat and reach the other side of the river. That's the plan. This is the plan. Let's do this. How far to the nearest crossing? The Brandywine Bridge. 20 miles. 20 miles. Okay. Oh, we are already here. Nice, nice one. I don't nice think one. we should be here. Alright, so we have... Let's actually check the graphics first of all. Do you see that? Frodo Baggins. This is Paddy Green Took. This is Mary and this is Samwise Gamgee. Look at the feet. Do you see that? Looks pretty nice to me. <laughs> Looks pretty good actually. Okay, let's keep moving. We need to now find the Prancing Pony. I'm assuming it's gonna be on the right side. Maybe even downside. I'm not sure. We will see. Okay. There is a wall, so we can't go any further, which makes sense. This is kind of the end of the map. I like the design, though. I mean, the Age of the Ring team here, they did a great job. And I can't wait for the Two Towers mission, which hopefully should be released in a couple of months. Okay, and there is nothing here too, right? I mean, we are just moving, but we don't know where the Prancing Pony is. Let's keep moving further, further, further. It's raining. They have no umbrellas. Umbrellas, you know? So we gotta be careful. I like the pictures too they are using here. Peri Peregrine Tog, Samwise. Pretty good, pretty good. Frodo is only level 1. Uh, is this the right place? Oh, we are, we are again at the wall. Hmm. I think, I mean, obviously the only possible way now is to go up. Let's do this. And it's raining too all the time. Uh, yeah, they make they make it of course a bit more complicated, which again I like a lot because I like challenges, you know. Okay, the right side is kind of there is nothing at the right side, so we need to move more in the center, I, I think. And once again, they are not able to move through the forest. They are only able. Okay, there is something. Okay, we found it. Nice one. We found it. That's the Brigitte. Okay. You can see also the animation at the bottom left side of your uh, screen in the minimap, you know? So we need to find the Prancing Pony, which is right here. And someone is waiting here. Look at this. Look look at this guy. Look at... What is this design, though? Look his beard. It's so realistic. You see that, guys? That looks dope. Aragorn. He looks like in the films, dude. Looks pretty good. And he's just waiting there like a king. He has also bow in his... Uh, he's like the stranger, you know? The strider. Sorry, not stranger. I mean, he's a stranger, but he's also strider. Can you tell him we've arrived? You draw far too much attention to yourself. What do you want? A little more caution from you. That is no trinket you carry. I carry nothing. Indeed. 
Indeed. Who are you? Are you frightened? Yes. Not nearly frightened enough. I know what hunts you. You can no longer wait for the wizard, Frodo. They're coming. They're coming? Oh, they are coming indeed. Holy moly. Run for your life. Run for your lives. They're attacking the city. They're attacking the city. There are few of us left. Let's actually wait here because we need to defend the prancing pony, right? So we don't need to move, right? So we can just stay here with all the units and just fight here in a safe spot. We have, well, arch we have archers, we have uh, archers here. Breakfast. And let's give them whole ground stands, the spike men, put them in the front. And all the archers and stuff like this, they're gonna be in the back, okay? Let's move a little bit further. And Aragorn can actually use the aggressive stance. So they are actually attacking us, but it should be fine. We can also give numbers now to our hobbits to, not, to make sure to not lose them. Nazgul has to disengage already. They are not dying, by the way. You can also only put them really low. And they are forced to run away. Quick okay, archers are doing a nice job. Quick fire. Elves. Okay. Don't give up. Ah. Right. Please do something, archers. Our pikemen are dying like crazy. And Aragorn also has to use aggressive sense with the sword and fights like a man. Like the king he is, you know? Prepare for another attack by the Black Riders, okay. If had the ring, we would know it. Do we have money? Oh, we can capture some buildings here, right? So, Hurry. yeah, let's do this real quick. Come on! Uh, let's do this. Aha. And you capture this one, please. Uh, wait, wait. Peregrine Sok. Um, yeah, we need to capture the farms. But what is a farm and what is an inn? It's a Bree building. I'm not sure. We will see. Use heroes to capture inns. Yeah, you can only capture with heroes, I believe. But I, I don't want to use Aragorn just yet. Okay, he's capturing this one pretty good, pretty good. And after capturing, we can always use the cloak ability from the Hobbits and get them invisible. Okay, so let's make pikemen. This, this. And one more archer. And one more pikemen too. Okay. We also captured this one very soon. This one is captured. We can make him invisible. He was also able to capture this one, we can make him also invisible. He was also able to capture this one, make him invisible, and also this one invisible, right, okay? So we're gonna the use this building for recruiting units through. because this is the closest They're building, of course, as you can see and tell. About. Our hobbits are in a safe spot and the Nazgul is coming. Um, gotta be careful. And you, we need to use the pikemen to deal with the Nazguls. Okay. Need archers on the field very soon. Archers can always use the aggressive stance. Go. Over here. Let's go like this. Nice. Aragon is face tanking. I'm fine with that. We have also heal. We need to keep this building protected. That's very important. With an aggressive stance. Make one more pikeman afterwards. We, can, we need to keep spamming units all the time. Just in case we're going to lose them, you know? But for now we are safe, I'm assuming. Put archers behind. And pikeman forward. More archers are coming. We need archers to kill this Ryzen Dunedain, and we, need, oh, we have still some buildings to capture. Yeah, but let's not do this one. I think we can, you know, we can only use this building, and we have also money, and these units are very, very cheap. Nazgul's are approaching the Prancing Pony. You gotta be careful about this. More units are coming, as you can see and tell. You gotta be careful. Keep this building protected, no matter what. Very important. And once again, archers, they should be protected by the pikemen. They won't take us. Talking about the pike man, right. he's forced yep. to retreat, okay? Right. Much to Next round is on you. All right, they're getting more Sounds units, but are they destroying our him? building? <gasps> what is this? Is deadly when provoked. Oh. oh no, how he was in, how he was our not invisible. Were brave, but that I'm not sure about this small. man, but luckily. We can actually load into it again. It's very hard. I, I was not paying attention for a single second. Maybe I should be moving with the hobbits also to the prancing pony. Hmm. Load this one. And let's get it started one more time. Hopefully we're going to be able to manage this one this time. Quite hard though. Um. I could swear I was actually making them invisible. But maybe when the units are coming out from the inn. They moved a little bit. And they when they move... 
They lose the invisibility. Okay. Quit fooling about. All right, let's let's go all back once again. Let's do the same what we have done before with all the units we got. And uh, we can use aggressive stance rocks with these guys. Give them once again numbers. These folks are dead. Okay. Can we already capture these buildings before the fight actually starts? This way we could save so much time. Yeah, let's do this actually, right? And there is one here, I believe. Where where was the building? Here. And one more. Um, hmm? I think one more was around this area, right? There we go. Let's, Let's go. start. Oh, the he's already moving there, okay? So where was the other building? I'm not sure. I can't see it. But let's capture them all before no, anything else big happens. Okay, now we can actually recruit some units very soon. Steady Once we deal on with these units, Aragorn can also use aggressive sense. And we are capturing all these buildings. Okay, this one is captured already. Frodo can move actually back. Did we capture this one too? Yeah, we did. Also, you can move back in this case. You can also move move back. Yeah, and where is the last dude? And he's here. He's actually doing nothing. Let's capture this one. So Come we have 35 on. seconds time. We can finally recruit some units now. Let's do this. Uh, Pikeman. Okay. Let's capture this one. Is this an inn or something? Apparently not. We need money. We need more money, you know? That's what we need. Okay, let's make some more units. Yeah, uh, Hobbits behind Aragorn, definitely. Samwise Gamju also behind. Let's put archers in the aggressive stance and let Pippin capture this one. Only five seconds left, though. Can we get invisible afterwards? That's the question. And we have to try it. We can't make it to the Prancing Pony anymore with Pippin. Needs one hour to capture this one. Come on, Pippin. Come on, Peregrine Took. Okay, we, we did it. Okay, we are invisible now with the suit. Pretty good, pretty good. You guys definitely need more make, need to make more units as soon as possible. Pikeman front uh, in the front side. We have any pikemen on the field? Yeah, we have pikemen now finally on the field. Aragorn has to take the fight here against the Nazgul. Pikemen are needed against the, against the Nazgul, you know? Because they are not gonna die very fast against the against the normal units we got. We give them all aggressive stands. Make one more pikeman. More units are coming from the left side. Um, okay, everyone is level 2 beside Peregrine Took. But we, was, we were also not able to capture this one just yet. Okay. There so we are for now left. safe. For now we are safe. Archers, be ready. We need. We are command points capped too. So we can't not even make any more units right now. Do we have any more pikemen? Do we have only one pikemen? No. If yes, put some pikemen in the front side. Okay. Um, Nazgul has entered the south gate. We are. We actually didn't capture many, many buildings, unfortunately. And we can't recruit any more units because of the command points we got. Nazgûls are approaching the Prancing Pony. From which side are they approaching though? I'm not sure. There is one. Settle down, man. Okay, I mean, we can use aggressive sands, mounted heroes like Nazgûls, they have no chance against pikemen. And also kill this. And then we can just peel back. We can also use height maybe, just so not. Let's use height. Okay, let's peel back now with this unit. Get more units on the field as soon as possible. Just make every any kind of unit to have some defense. Aragon is protecting this pathway. We are actually getting surrounded from all the possible sides. We need more archers on the field. We are losing stuff all the time. We don't have also that much money. Hobbits are doing not bad defending. Don't give up. Move around. We have, I wish we would go for the rallying call. Let's use heal here to sustain that to sustain to sustain them over time. I can't even talk. More archers are needed. Aggressive stance. Make them stronger. Are we safe for now? That's the question, though. I mean, I don't know how many more units are gonna come eventually. There are some more here from the right side. Okay. We need more pikemen. Archers behind, pikemen forward. Nazgûls are approaching the prancing uh, pony one more time. Where is the Nazgûl? I can't see him. No, your other right. Please attack. Attack them. Oh, they are, they are good. They are good. Nice. Okay, we are safe for now. The Nazgul is coming, but Aragorn should be able to take him down in no time. Keep your nose out of trouble. Or we can turn against this Nazgul, no big deal. Yeah, grab Quick, bow and run. 
again, you know, Pikes against Nazgul's very, very strong. Don't let okay. them scare you, yeah, bullies. Ooh, yeah. Nazgul is forced Buggers. to retreat. Let's kill back with the pikemen. Try to use porcupine formation to keep the archers protected. The porcupine they are way tanky, of course. Uh, we can't even make more units now. I believe we are in a good spot. This one is looking much, much better. Maybe it's because of the help of the hobbits. Unfortunately, I was not paying attention about the hobbit we had. And we lost the first try, but... You guys wanted to see me fail sometimes. Here we go. <laughs> Here we go. Stay alert, man. I like it when it's hot. I like it when, when it's difficult, you know? Kill the Nazgul. We need more units definitely very soon. But we are recovering also over time. Kill this, ar kill this uh, swordman. With the archers. Aragorn is also going to hit level 2 very soon. He has a very TC of Faithful Protector. With level 5. And then you have the Leader of Men. Uh, Nerby friendly units gain 33% armor. When activated units near Aragon gain temporarily 50% damage and immunity to terror. Okay. So let's make more units. We can afford it. Archers to actually kill the fight around this side. You are a seal those air indeed, Aragon. We know that. You don't need to be bragging about it all the time. Keep an eye out for vagrants. Okay. To your right. No, your other right. Ready for orders. We did it. We did it, guys. We did it. Nice. So we did it. But is this is this all we have to do? That's the question. They are the Nazgul, ring wraiths. At all times, they feel the presence of the ring. They will never stop hunting you. They will never stop hunting you. The famous words of Aragorn. Into the wild. But where is he leading us? Rivendell, Master Gamji. In the house of Elrond. Did you hear that? We're going to see the elves. Victorious. Just like that. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. If you did, please don't forget to leave a like on this video. And subscribe for more content like this. Uh, it was pretty enjoyable for me. It was hard. We failed one time. And... Let's see what, how many times we're gonna feel until the very end of the Fellowship of the Ring campaign in Age of the Ring for BFME 2, The Rise of the Witch King. I see you next time. Until then, take care of yourselves and as always, stay beyond standards. Peace, guys.